Alright, let's do some mail. Okay, it's just one card. Okay, two. Uh, Edmundo Sosa. I've been kind of buying this guy's stuff up. He's a pretty, pretty good young prospect, and who knows down the road he could, he could become a star. And if I pick up a ton of these for you know three bucks, five bucks, it'd be nice. Kind of just want that to happen a couple of times. Seems like it'd be pretty neat. We got some vintage here. Oh, that's cool. 72 tops, Reggie Jackson, PSA 7. Love the uh, design on this, these tops. Is, and it's got the new uh, hologram, so it's, it was just slabbed within. Well, it could have been sent off to put into the uh, uh, reholder, like put into the new slab, but could have been graded recently, off centering. But nice looking card. Let's see how much that was. It's always cool to tell the prices. Uh, Nineteen twenty-five shipped. It's not bad. Alex Blandino, shortstop prospect for the Reds. These are some Bowman Chrome Autos, just base. I think uh, these were $10 shipped for both, so about 5 bucks per card. Not bad. This is cool. I forgot how much I paid, but 76 top, so it's Brett's second year card and PSA 7. Card looks really nice. Here's the back of it. Nice looking card. <clears throat> <laughs> More vintage. It seems like that's all I've been buying lately. Bowman Chrome cards for, for baseball and then vintage. Oh, this is a nice one. This is Brett's third year, 77. This is a PSA 9. This one was about 75 bucks, so pretty pricey. But to, to get a card this old, PSA 9. Isn't the easiest, and it's, it's George Brad, so I like this one. It's crazy though. You you can buy a PSA eight in this card for fifteen bucks, but if you go up to a nine, it's like seventy five to ninety. But that, that's a cool Brett. Um, this is a really cool card. Let's see how much I paid. Jose Fernandez. I don't have this card. Yeah, pricey. 138. Uh, Bowman Chrome Refractor. PSA 9. Um, for some reason, if people don't like Bowman, Bowman Chrome cards, auto slabs when they're not at least like a 9.5 Beckett or 10 PSA. I don't, I don't mind getting a PSA 9 of this. 
Still a nice car. This car can still have a lot of problems, scratches, little um, dimples in it. So, Jose Fernandez this is the refractor version to 500. This is a Chrome Draft 2011. So, nice card. Okay, this is from Platinum Card Breaks. This is an Brandon Cooks NFL gear. I got the Saints in one of the PYTs just for the hell of it. It was like 40 bucks, so. It's a nice Cooks. It's probably worth 15 bucks or so. It's a 99. Beckett card, <laughs> Francisco Lindor. He actually, he actually had a three-run home run against my team last night. Thirty-five. Um, this is a Beckett nine, just like I was talking about. It's a, a Chrome model card that's not gem mint, which doesn't bother me. Corners are eight five, so I have to look closer at it. But this is out of five hundred. This is just like the uh, Jose Fernandez card, exact same set, and out of five hundred, so. Nice guy. I, th I, th I think this kid's going to be good. Mm. Last one. Ending with some Ernie Banks, Mr. Cub. Cool. This Banks is 1960, which is probably my favorite vintage top set. PSA 6, nice example of this card. Man, he looks young there. Ernie Banks. It's got a little pr um, print. It's a yellow circle dot here, which is probably common for that era. Let's take a look at the back. It's always cool to see the backs of these cards, too, because they always have the little cartoons. <laughs> Alright guys, that's it for this one.